Welcome back to City Scenes. I'm your host for the week, Kristen Starling from Customer Service here at the City of LaGrange. I'll be going over the events in and around LaGrange from November the 8th to the 14th, so let's get started. November 11th is Veterans Day, and to honor those who have served, Hills and Dales is offering complimentary admission from Tuesday to Saturday for all those who have previously served or are currently serving in the armed forces. Thank you for your service. For more information, please email info at hillsanddales.org or call 706-882-3242. Get Troop Reading is hosting a family festival on Tuesday, November 9th from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. featuring Malcolm Mitchell, author, Super Bowl champion, and founder of Share the Magic Foundation. There will be free Kona ice, Crave cookies, and Malcolm's book, my very favorite book in the whole wide world will be given out to the first 400 children to visit the TCSS L4GA resource table. Come out to South Bend Park for this great cause. The LaGrange Symphony Orchestra is hosting a Colors and Contrasts concert on Tuesday the 9th at 7.30 p.m. They will be performing Mendelssohn's String Symphony No. 1 in C major, Handel's Harp Concerto No. 6 in B flat major, featuring LSO's harpist, Daniel Lane, Pryor's Canticle of Shadows, and Dvorak's Serenade for Strings in E major. The concert is general admission seating and located at First United Methodist, 401 Broad Street. Tickets can be purchased online at lagrangesymphony.org. It's $20 for adults, students 13 and older are $5, and it's free for children 12 and under. Please consult the LSO's website for COVID protocols. Brian Wright and Sally J are performing at Pure Life Studios Thursday, November 11th at 7.30 p.m. Brian Wright is a Texas-born artist, producer, songwriter, multi-instrumentalist, poet, rock and roll guitarist, and psychedelic troubadour, while Sally J is an American folk singer-songwriter who has recorded one major solo album, Amarillo, but has also appeared on several other albums as a member of a group. Tickets start at $17.50. Go to purelifelagrange.com for more information. Georgia Living Senior Home Care is hosting a barbecue plate fundraiser to benefit the Walk to End Alzheimer's. For $10 cash or Venmo, you can get a sandwich, slaw, beans, chips, a fresh baked Otis Bunkmeyer cookie, and a drink. Pickup will be at 112 Old Airport Road on November the 12th from 11.30 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. The Homeschool Drama Club's fall show is off to Neverland for two shows this upcoming weekend. They'll be performing Peter Pan on Friday the 12th at 6.30 p.m. and Saturday the 13th at 2.30 p.m. The performances will take place at Franklin Road Baptist Church, 1424 New Franklin Road. So join Peter, Wendy, John, and Michael as they set off on an adventure so they don't have to grow up. Tickets are just $5. On Saturday the 13th from 9 a.m. to noon, go to the Center for Creative Learning located at 112 Lafayette Parkway to learn about intergenerational trauma transmission. This is a free event open to the public. You will gain a basic understanding of the biological research supporting the theory of intergenerational transmission of trauma. Learn the effects of transgenerational trauma on marginalized populations with a focus on the historical trauma of these groups. Raise awareness of our own unconscious bias that may be perpetuating this historical trauma on marginalized populations. For more information, call Chalton Askew, 706-402-1311. Hills and Dales is hosting an adult gingerbread house workshop on Saturday the 13th from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Floral designer David Brown will walk you through the intricacies of designing a beautiful gingerbread house for your holiday table. Supplies will be provided. Participants should bring their imaginations, more of their favorite candies, and anything special you want to add to your design. The cost is $65 per person. Call 706-882-3242 or email info at hillsanddales.org to register. Pretty Good Books is hosting an author event featuring Kay Lanning Minchu. Kay was the executive director of the Troop County Historical Society and Archives for more than 30 years. Now retired, she serves as an archival consultant and lives in LaGrange, Georgia. Join in on Saturday, November 13th at 1 p.m. as she discusses her latest book, G 
Jimmy Carter, Citizen of the South. Pretty Good Books is located at 118 Church Street in downtown LaGrange. Wild Leaf's annual grilled cheese showdown is back with a new fall flavored edition, Soup. Join them for what will surely be one of the biggest events of the year on Saturday the 13th from 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. There will be one day only beers, cocktails, and slushies. This is a free event for all ages, so come out to vote for your favorite grilled cheese. Wild Leap is located at 308 Main Street. And lastly, come join the Sons of Lafayette for a musical road trip on Sunday the 14th at 4 p.m. at First United Methodist. There will be lots of familiar tunes as well as some new ones. You, your family, and friends are sure to find something to enjoy. Stay after the concert and meet the choir. Tickets are available from choir members, Plum Southern, Marketplace at Lafayette Square, and Heron Company. These are the events happening in LaGrange this week of November the 8th to the 14th. We hope you can get out, have fun, and stay safe. And from everyone at the city, I'd like to congratulate the Atlanta Braves for winning the World Series. Way to go, Braves! For the City of LaGrange, I'm Kristen Starling. Have a great week.